So, my lefties out there, it looks like you owe my righties out there an apology if you want to help Palestine. I'm getting a lot of people assuming that because I support Palestine that I supported the COVID agenda and that I'm triple vaccinated and quadruple boosted, right? So there's this association with the mostly left-leaning people who are very vocal for the liberation of Palestine. That is having a trigger response to the people on the right who are unaware of the apartheid in Palestine and just blindly kind of follow the warring agenda. They don't even think deeply about it. But they're not even willing to think deeply about it because all they're seeing is the left-leaning people being very vocal again and not realizing that this time the left are actually in the right. Because before, mostly left-leaning people were very vocal about forcing others to get a vaccination. And that was a major trauma for people. I'm not vaccinated and it's okay if you are vaccinated, but what happened during the COVID agenda was that mostly right-leaning people weren't buying into it and they didn't want to get vaccinations. And we saw a lot of left-leaning people remaining totally quiet while right people, right-leaning people, were losing their jobs for not getting the vaccination, were being ostracized blatantly by family members. I still have a friend who hasn't told her closest four friends that she isn't vaccinated because she was afraid of being excluded. So mostly left-leaning people bought into the COVID story and they remained quiet while their own citizenry, mostly people on the right, were being utterly traumatized by the COVID agenda crossing body sovereignty lines. The enforcement of putting a substance into the flesh. That was a major trauma for people. It was a major trauma for myself. So now we have a lot of left-leaning people rightfully this time speaking for the liberation of Palestinians. Okay, because it's the counter narrative. The main media wants you to believe in the Israel story, just like the main media wanted you to believe in the COVID agenda. Okay, so this time a lot of left leaning people are seeing through that media propaganda and they are supporting the correct cause, which is the liberation of a colonized people, the Palestinians. But all the people on the right, who are mostly kind of, a lot of them are inside a form of Christian Zionism and dogma, they're unwilling to even have the conversation because all they're seeing is left-leaning people being very vocal again, just like they were during COVID. And that is a trauma mechanism for people on the right because you left them hanging. You shamed them for not getting the vaccination. You remained quiet when they lost their jobs and they deserve an apology. And if any of you out there, it's okay, we all make mistakes, but if anybody out there did that to other people or remained silent in the face of other people making their own personal choice not to get vaccinated and you shamed for th them for that and you remained silent when they lost things because of that, you owe them an apology if you want them to listen to the reality of what's happening in Palestine. Because that's why the right isn't listening, because they're just seeing the left going off again. And they're like, oh, my God, this is just like the COVID thing that happens to us. That's what's happening here. They're in a trigger. They're in a trigger response. So we're going to need to come together here. And any lefties or any righties, but it's mostly lefties. If you did that to any people, you, they deserve an apology if you want them to hear about what's happening in Palestine. And oh yeah, just to reiterate that COVID was rolled out by Zionist Jews. You can scroll down uh, my feed and you can find the names of the highest ranking people in the whole COVID agenda from the head of the CDC all the way through. Every aspect of COVID was rolled out by Zionist Jews. So the same um, Zionistic entity that rolled out COVID is the same Zionistic entity genociding Palestinians. So the people that were aware of the COVID uh, agenda it's no it's okay if you weren't it's fine i'm just saying the same people behind that are the same people genociding palestinians it's the the, the same entity and they're keeping the american citizenry in opposition so oh lefties uh, fell for the COVID thing and the right didn't now the right are falling for israel's propaganda and the left aren't but if you guys could just come together together and realize both of these scenarios are zionist jews and one side uh, does, uh, owes the other side an apology. And then we can start speaking about the common enemy here. Okay.